ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਲਾਈਵ ਟੀਵੀ ਦੇਖ ਰਹੇ ਸਾਰੇ ਦਰਸ਼ਕਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਮੇਰੇ ਵੱਲੋਂ ਰੋਜੀ ਖਹਿਰੇ ਵੱਲੋਂ ਪਿਆਰ ਭਰੀ ਸਤਿ ਸ਼੍ਰੀ ਅਕਾਲ ਅੱਜ ਅਸੀਂ ਖੜੇ ਆ ਰਾਇਲ ਕਿੰਗਸ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਕਬੱਡੀ ਕੱਪ ਤੇ ਤੇ ਸਾਡੇ ਨਾਲ ਕਬੱਡੀ ਜਗਤ ਦਾ ਉਹ ਮਹਾਨ ਖਿਡਾਰੀ ਜਿਸ ਨੇ ਕਬੱਡੀ ਜਿਸ ਨੂੰ ਆਪਣੇ ਵਿਰਸੇ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚੋਂ ਨਹੀਂ ਮਿਲੀ ਪਰ ਉਹ ਕਬੱਡੀ ਦੀ ਦੁਨੀਆ ਦਾ ਸੁਪਰ ਸਟਾਰ ਹੈ ਜੈਰੋ ਚੋਵੇਸ ਸਾਡੇ ਨਾਲ ਨੇ ਜੈਰੋ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਗੱਲ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਫਰਸਟ ਆਫ ਆਲ ਜੈਰੋ ਮੋਸਟ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਟੂ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਲਾਈਵ ਟੀਵੀ Jero I noticed on your social media like you both brothers are always very excited when you come to Australia it's the like the weather over here you like or you like the audience over here or is there any other particular reason you come to visit Australia all the time so man yeah um what what are the biggest biggest reasons that I that I love coming out here is because I have a family out here you know Rana and and Amen and uh I just the love that I get from them it's like I'm home so and then on top of that when I get in the stadium in the ground uh there's nowhere like it in the world uh so for me coming to australia is like i'm coming home so usa is my home but when i come over here it's, it's my home town again like i've i've grown here now I, i've been playing here because of rana and like you know this, that's my dad so that's why i enjoy coming over here means like australia is your second home we can say that uh okay yero um i just wanted to ask like uh, you know the 99% of uh, like the players from this game it's belongs to Punjab or India but you both brothers are the super duper stars of kabaddi you didn't get this uh, game from your culture it's not nowhere in close to your heritage like someone introduced to you to this game or you stepped into this game by yourself yeah no i had a friend uh, gurpreet singh from yuba city he uh, he kind of saw the potential in me and my brother and he he would always invite us but we were always busy uh One year there was a tournament in our town in Yuba City and he was he called us come on come through come come play and um uh, there's wrestling so we go, whoa there's wrestling like olympic style wrestling and that kind of got us whoa let, let's go we ended up going and wrestling and we saw the sport we we were like man that's that's a warrior sport you know that's you know I'm Mexican and the Punjabi community we have like the same culture we have the same warrior blood so when I saw that sport, sport i said this is what i meant to do this i love this this is everything i've done my whole life all in one you know it's even harder you have no shoes you're on grass you're on dirt so i i just instantly fell in love with it and it's it's history from there you know we we studied so much uh me and my brother we trained so much together uh we had some of the legends show us how to play the game little techniques so in Uh, like I have nothing but respect for this sport and I love it but it's in my blood okay what is in your blood uh Jero I just uh, I saw your post on social media on the Facebook like uh, today there is the one biggest quaddy cup is play, being played in US like in Philadelphia you maybe his Jesus is playing over there that's why he's not here but you posted over there there's a lot of uh, uh we can see the politics in the this game kabaddi uh what do you mean by this and uh, what do you think what needs to be done to improve kabaddi and to take it to the next level Yeah, I mean, it, it's pretty simple. You know, the the politics, every sport is going to have politics, good or bad. Um, but I I think I think it's going in the right direction. I just being that I'm from the US, there there should be some kind of thing where if there's a US tournament, I should be there. That's I'm represent I re- always represent USA and uh I'm I am happy to do that. And so when when they tell me I can't play and certain other players can't play, um and they're vague about it I'm, I and I'm not sure why you know there there was a something went on with the uh, Canada with the anti doping agency and I was clear and so when they announced to the world that I'm clear and they they clear my name uh it shouldn't be an issue from then on and I've tested many 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 times now at every tournament and I'm clear and I I love the testing I I and when I hear their testing I get happy because now we're all on the same playing field. And so I like I said I I support it 1000%. I'm happy and that's going in the right direction and this last this year in Canada it was great. Everybody was playing and nobody got hurt. If you see there was no huge injuries. And that's a big I I want to just thank thank them for that and let's keep it going, you know. Let's there's a lot of politics with different federations not liking each other, but let's just all get along. Like I'm seeing that they're all starting to sign and get along that makes me happy you know I I want to have many many years to play this sport 
I'm going to be around for a long time. So if I have a good game, if I have a bad game, I, I stay with the people who take care of me like Rana. Whether I have a good game or a bad game, I'm his son. He's going to take care of me. I have a new sponsor, Pumpkin, from New York. He, you know, I can tell that he loves me. And he's going to take care of me no matter what, whether I play or don't play. So things like that, when I get sponsors like that, I get excited. I want to play. I want to play good for them and not only for me, for myself, for the team. So that's that's how I feel. And I'm just I'm glad that I have those people. Uh, yeah, you know, I just uh, saw before when you was playing against uh, other players in the in the in the game today, uh, there was a like a controversy, and you almost left that uh, left the field. Uh, what happened over there? Like, uh, what you noticed over there? Like, uh, you didn't feel well. Like, it's it's not like it's safe to play like that. What was there? Yeah, you know, I I get picked on a lot. You know, just just because I'm I'm not Punjabi, I get picked, up a little, picked on a little more than most players. But uh, you know, I've been playing for nine years. I you know that. There's nothing that they could do to me that I'm, I haven't seen already. So I, they always wipe me extra, and they always complain, oil this and look, you know, bomb uh, or whatnot. But I'm in the locker room with these guys. You know, I'm, the team that I'm playing against next week, I'm on on their team, and you know, they're telling me, put this, do this, do that, do this. So then, when I'm playing against them, and they're, oh, th- what are you doing? I'm like, we're, you know, we play the same sport, right? It's a part like I, I'm not doing anything that the other Raiders aren't doing. You know, I'm I'm if anything, I'm doing less because I get, you know, I'm getting that guy. Let's let's check him more. So at the end of the day, when someone wants when one of the stoppers wants to, you know, wants to say something to me, I, I, I don't like it. I get upset because I just played with you three tournaments ago and you were telling me to put this on to do this. And I'm like, you know, we're we're all at the end of the day when the the tournament's over we're all friends so there's no need to, to pick on anybody and that's a, another thing that's why i like pala you know he's one of the best stoppers in the world and that's why i respect him because he's never said hey oh oil he's never said that to me he never came up to me and wiped me down because he respects me and he knows that when you're the best in the world it doesn't matter it doesn't matter what you put on i'm going to stop you and so i was a, one of the best stoppers in the world and I never, I never wiped anybody down. I never complained about somebody because, buddy, you have to grab something, grab something else, grab the waist. You got to work, 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 work. You can't just grab an ankle. You just can't grab a wrist. It's, you know, there's a lot of technique. And so that's why I get upset, you know, and, you know, and there's certain moves that are illegal. And it's a part of the game. Yeah. And there's certain moves that you're not supposed to do. And I've been playing for nine years, so I know the rules. I know I have a lot of technique and people... I don't know, but I watch a lot of video. My life is all about me, buddy. I, I live it. I breathe it. So when I'm out there, I'm not just doing things by accident. I'm, I'm getting out because I'm, I am I work hard. I train hard. Me and my brother, we both, we do everything. So so when we're out there, it's not just, oh, he got away. He's lucky. No, I, I train that. You know, so. So you already mentioned like Lapalapala Jalalpur is your uh, like a favorite uh, stopper. Like uh, you like to play against him. Uh, apart from Pala, is there any other uh, like the Kabaddi stoppers like you like to play against them? Like any names or just only Pala who give you a tough competition? You said that he's a great player. Like he's never complained like, oh, Jero, this is that, this is that. He just come over there. If he stops you if, or if you get the point from them or from, you, or from him, if you get the point from him, um, you you okay and he's okay. It's a game like a... Uh, you have to raid and they have to catch. And uh, Pala is the best in your eyes. Uh, apart from Pala, is there any other players you like? Yeah, no. I mean, like if you, if you look at the Bay Area team uh, in the uh, U.S., I really love the stop line that they have. Sandeep, Yad, Kotli, and Pala, obviously. And sometimes they, they move around. They got Cushy in there. So I get excited playing that stop line because it makes me better. No, there's no other Raider that's playing that stop line and getting away the way I am. And when I play others, when they're scattered around, when the players are scattered around, Pala's here, Christian over here, I don't get better because I know who the good guy is and I just, I can play on him. I can watch him. It's easier. It's an easier game. When they're all together, that makes me better. I, I want to go raid. I, I want to keep, I want to see how tired I can get and keep going. And I want to, that, so I love playing against those kinds of stop lines. When those guys are together, it make it's to, to get away. It, it's very hard to get away, and that it gets me excited. So 
all those guys in the Bay, I love that top line, and I always look forward to playing against the best top lines because it makes me better. It makes days like this over here where the, the players are a little more scattered, you know, that you don't get the, the super, super stars all in one. That, to me, I'm like, okay, I can practice. I'm practicing a little more, trying new things. With them, you got to come correct every time. you got to play right. You can't, one little mistake, you're getting stopped. It's a 40-minute match, you know, so you, yeah. So it means you're saying, like, the barrier stop line is the world's most, like, we can say the best stop line in the world, and you like to play against the best players. That gives you, like, a more excitement in this game. So uh, today is the final against the same team. Same guys will be there. How are you looking from here today? Uh, I'm just looking at it. I'm going to I'm gonna adjust a little bit. Um, obviously, uh, I've been watching the tournament. Certain players didn't play the semis, so they're going to be a little more fresh. So I just got to watch out for, this, for little setups and uh, just, um, you know, just stay focused and calm and just play every raid, one raid at a time. And uh, I think... It should be a good match. It's going to be an exciting match. Uh, everybody should tune in for this one. Yeah, uh, you are the favorite of like uh, every person. Where they can find you on the, on the on the social media? Well, yeah. Well, they can find me on Instagram, Jairo Chavez twenty two J A I R O C H A V E Z two two. So that's my Instagram, and obviously, if you just type in Jairo Chavez, you can find my Facebook. But uh, you know, come support. Uh, if you guys love Kabaddi, then you're gonna love my my page. Okay, Yaro, uh, last thing, I just forgot to ask. What's your dad name and what's your mom name? Okay, so my dad's name is Manuel Chavez and my mom's name is Rosa Chavez. All right, thank you, Yaro. Thanks for the time. Thank you.